My colleague, News Channel 5 meteorologist Kelly Cox has moved from the Weather Center to the Talk of the Town <laughs> kitchen. She and her daughter Madeline. Hey, Madeline, how you doing? Give a good Wave night. to everybody out there. <laughs> yeah. All right, Madeline and Kelly are here to make Kelly's very vanilla banana pudding. Mm -hmm. Good to have you all with us today. So is she a big help in the kitchen for you? She is a huge helper in the kitchen. She loves to help me and Daddy in the kitchen, both of us. Uh -huh. She loves to help, and I think she's eventually going to be the chef of the house oh. when she gets a little bigger. So she's already helping, and she's a huge fan of bananas. Okay. And I mean, what kid isn't a fan of cookies? So Madeline, we've got a job for you, okay? Help get the cookies out of the box and then into the bowl, all okay? right? Okay. I always mm -hmm. think it's great to give them something to do when you're cooking with kids yes. because, you know, it keeps them busy and then they get that great sense of accomplishment. So <laughs> she's going to help with that. Uh, she sees herself on TV, too. So that's oh, <laughs> that's always fun. So while we prepare the pudding, she's going to get the cookies ready. OK, and I just pour in the milk. And All right. So, so just what, two glasses of milk, two cups of okay. milk and then the pudding. And if you're doing a bigger one, obviously, just prepare it by the directions mm -hmm. in case you get one of the bigger packs. But that's all you need to know is prepare by the directions. Mommy, okay. Good too. Two cookies. We'll put them both in that. Put them both in there for us. Put all the cookies you can in there. And then you whisk this just like mm -hmm. it says. Okay. And if you'll take over this for a second. I'll do that for you. Okay. Yeah, you can be our expert whisker. All righty. Then these are the two ingredients that I put in that's kind of different. That makes I it very vanilla. 40 cookies. 40 cookies. Oh, look right at there. there. She can get so many cookies <laughs> at a time. So I put in a little bit of Mexican vanilla. If you can't find Mexican vanilla, then just use regular vanilla, but I just think it gives it that extra little boost. I don't know that I have had that, but I, I remember taking a cruise and going to Cozumel, and it was like, they were selling this like pop down there. It was yes. like in boxes everywhere on the corner. It's really, it's really, really tasty. Now fill okay. this all up, Madeline. Okay, and then the other thing that I do is take some whipped topping or mm -hmm. Cool Whip, whichever you like to call it. Okay. And then I put about half of it right in there and then just mix it on in. All righty. So we'll go about mm, maybe a little bit more than half of it. And this is what makes it so light and fluffy. All righty. And then the rest of it I just save, save out for a topping. So get that all mixed in okay, there. Okay, cool. And while you're beating that, Madeline, okay, we all got right. all the cookies. And she was really, we had to see what she could do yesterday. Yeah. Help us do the bananas one by one. And we put bananas in the uh, bottom. So while the you're doing that, I want to talk to you. The reason that yeah. we've got you here and we've got uh, Henry and Bree will be on as well here in the, in the days to come. Ron's retiring I know. after new, over, what, uh, 36 years here at I the know. station. I know. It's hard to believe. I mean, I don't know if you're like me, but it's going to be hard to picture a world without Ron here. Exactly, you know? yes. It, it is so funny to try to picture, oh, mm -hmm. Madeline, did you lick your yeah. fingers? So as she continues <laughs> to do off. that, and uh, yeah, Chief Meteorologist Ron House is going to retire, I believe Wednesday, May 25th at 6 p.m. is going to be the last official newscast here. And uh, I remember when I was working in Bristol, uh, I was working the afternoon shift for our chief guy up there, and I got yeah. this phone call from out of the blue. Ron says, hey, we've heard some nice things about you. Send us a tape. And, uh, I sent a tape in and a couple of months went by and I thought it was in file 13 somewhere. And, and then I get a call back that says, hey, come on down. We've narrowed this thing down to three people. Uh, you and I actually had a chance to meet briefly yes. before you started here because exactly. you worked at the, the CBS station up there where a good friend who actually used to work here yes. worked. And so you called me when you heard about the opening. I did. And then you helped get the tape into Ron's hands. And Ron had a, and his wife, Cindy, uh -huh. looked over the tape. And of course, the news director at the time and, and and helped me get the job here and you know and it's been a wonderful 10 years I've been here 10 years of course Ron 36 that's uh -huh. hard to imagine but exactly it's been wonderful and I think one of the biggest the best things about Ron that people may not know uh -huh. is how funny he is <laughs> he, is, he really, you really is. don't uh -huh. know yeah. I love you too Madeline look at my sweet little sous chef <laughs> all right so they're going to finish this up and then you just kind of layer this uh, you yes. will find Kelly's very vanilla banana pudding on the Come website on. at newschannel5.com and again, look for Henry and Bree in the days to come here and Ron's big final day coming up on May 25th on News Channel 5 yes. at 6 o'clock. We're going to miss him big time. We here. are going to miss him big time. So, Madeline, thank you so much for your help. Wave bye-bye to everybody, Wave bye -bye Madeline. Wave bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.